Do you know there was actually a study done by American University in Cornell with AI and conspiracy theories? I love this. I need to read this study. Yes. I'll tell you why. It is very cool. This is the best rabbit hole ever. Adam, I'm sorry, brother. (laughs) We're already there. The cool thing is, and I didn't even know this. Did you know there is like a baseline for conspiracy theories index kind of thing? I I had yeah. So what do you mean? So take your take all your take all your conspiracy theories. It's like if you believe all these conspiracy theories, there is now a baseline that you can be indexed by. So you know you're ranked like zero to one hundred. Let's say, Mm -hmm. all right, this is how like conspiracy theory mindset that you're looking into, kind of thing. I was like, oh, okay. Did had no idea that existed, but what they did is in this study they took two two thousand people. And they said, okay, we're going to present information to you based on your specific conspiracy theory that you're putting into this AI model. <laughs> wow. And it's called debunk, debunk bot is what it's called. Okay. Um, the debunk bot. Yes. And so you go in there and you put in this conspiracy theory that you are set on. And it's – That you're set in, on. In the course of this information, in this conversation with this chat bot, it's basically an eight-minute conversation. And they did it for like three three conversations in eight minutes. And it presented information to the person that said, this is why it's not real. And so after that eight minutes, what they came away with is when they finished the study, 20% of the participants reduced their belief in the okay. certain conspiracy theories. Interesting. And another quarter, quarter like 25. 25% of that, actually ended up being really uncertain whether or not they were even existed, that conspiracy theory even existed. So it was kind of interesting. 25% of the of 20%? Of the 20, right. Okay. So, so it was really interesting to read that kind of stuff. And I'm just sitting here thinking, that, I'm that like. That surprises me 